Good evening, Surrey Hills and other people. Um, welcome to, there it is, there's that super. I was looking for that. Uh, Dean here from JJ Spice. Uh, welcome to uh, Surrey Hills Live for what, the eighth time now? It's incredible. Uh, I want to acknowledge the traditional owners of the land, the Gadigal people of the Eora Nation, and pay our respects to the elders past and present. Um, and uh, welcome you to uh, at what is going to be an insanely amazing night. We have got Jesse Squire, we've got Fables, and uh, look what I've got. It's Thursday, 7.30. Time to open a Hawks. This is the delicious Hawks lager. We have got Rob in the house. How are you, Rob? I am freaking fantastic, I tell you what. Uh, I don't. We have such an epic show for everyone out there tonight. We've got uh, Mr. J Squire, who's standing up just to my left. And he's going to be amazing. I just sound checked him and he sounds just sweet as butter if you added sugar to butter. Uh, it's just gorgeous. Um, and then uh, after um, Jay, we have my new favorite band, uh, Fables, who have the most epic, epic set for you coming up. It's, it's something you can, you can cry to and dance to simultaneously. And I'm very jealous. <laughs> if you can cry and dance at the same cry time to music, dance. Is that like crass that's debate? like is that holy like crass crap, debate? right? Pardon? <laughs> is, is that like is that like crass debate? Crass debate. <laughs> I think a lot of people have been doing a lot of crass debate. Crass debate, the last, yeah. Well, the last few weeks. I well, know, look, you can crass debate it week, as as, as, as well. <laughs> Just you know, get on your crass debate, and uh, no, this is going to be a it's fabulous. Gonna be epic. So it's going to be huge. Tonight's going to be huge. It's number you know what eight. Else we got. You know what else we got? We got Kathy Lou bringing us another like crazy. Kathy Lou. She's fantastic. Kathy, love Kathy. We also have Mr. Cody Dillon in the house. Woo! Woo, Cody, uh, and he's he's for the last few weeks he's been very busy. You know, you know, some of you have been watching Netflix. Cody Dillon has been creating tunes um, for for everyone to enjoy at home called Quarren Tunes, and we're going to listen to some of that, and we're going to interview Cody later about that. It's going to be very fun. But I'm, I'm rabbiting on as usual at the beginning of the show. I really, really, really want to listen to to Jay Squire and his sweet, sweet tunes. So I'm going to give it over to Jay. We get a shot on Jay. Woo! Here he is. Hello. Jay Squire. Jay Squire, last time, last time I, I was with you, we were at the Shakespeare Hotel. We were. And you were bringing yeah. down the house. We had Tom Hesp after you. And that was good. That was a good night. That was the last gig I did before the Great Flood. The Great Flood. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah, no, I remember that well. And you've just, you just released an EP. I did. I did that. It was funny because I put myself into isolation in February to record it. And then I sort of like, I didn't see anyone for about a month and I recorded it. And then I was like, you know, I walked out of my room and I was like, oh, okay, cool. I can be out again now. And then all this happened. So I was like, okay, back in. <laughs> so I'm working on the second one now. That's a two part EP. Um, it's the first one's called Sub Rosa Volume One, um, which means in secret, it's Latin for under the petal of a rose. Cool, um, beautiful. So it's just songs from a secretive place, which is pretty fitting at the moment. I guess you'd say. Yeah. Well, yeah. they're sounding beautiful, man. They're beautiful songs. And uh, I'm you. very happy to have you here. The sound check was beautiful. It's going to be even better now. So at home, get you, plug this into the best stereo that you have or your headphones or whatever and relax and enjoy. This is Jay Squire at Surrey Hills Live. I've had many different dances in my dreams I've been a harp without a mind I've just been wandering around Not giving any chances to any damn thing that I see Awake, awake, a train goes by to the countryside Where the air is dry and there's no means for an end in the end There's a gasoline bottle in and I know that I can no longer pretend So, has the highway lifted up your precious soul? Well, I'm hoping that one day I'll get to know You finish off your drink and fly your flag As you move on down the road So 
There are so many borders you patrol. Well, I can't get past you, build them up so tall. It's written in the wind above your home. A skull and crossbones. Well, I repeat the mantra every day to try and make it watertight. But there's a crack inside the center anyway I put flowers on the wall and try to celebrate the dead At any conscious moment of the day I try to study cycles but I know That the truth is a different thing entirely to belief Most days I don't about what it is I am Cause I think that there's too much power in deceit So There's a highway helping you to feel more slow Yeah, I'm hoping that one day I'll get to know And I hope you're feeling honest Cause the sweetest me is closest to the bone So there are so many borders you patrol Well, I can't get past you, build them up so tall It's written in the wind above your home A skull and crossbones It's written in the wind above your home A skull Skull and Crossbones, that was off my first uh, EP, Little Arrow, who, uh, was which was produced by Darby, who you had in last week, I think it was. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, but I'll play now, I think. She was great. Oh, it was so good. I watched it. Ross, yeah. Ross and Darby. And Pan well, Pacific Grand Prix. Well, and um, going off that as well, furthering the collab, the EP I've just put out, Sub Rosa Volume 1, is getting put out by a label that Ross has been working on. Ah, yeah, great. Um, yeah. Evening Records, so. We um, talked about that. out there, yeah, check out Evening Records. He's doing, he's doing a great thing. He's get, doing get, a great getting thing. Getting that it's just Newtown sound. to be under, and yeah, it's really good. Yeah. I'm totally about it. Yeah. Um, so yeah, e really Evening happy. Records, get on it. Get, a, get, get on, on it. Records. Great name. Yeah, it's a good name, isn't it? Yeah. Shout out, shout out to Pan Pacific Grand Prix and Derby Music from last yeah, he week. Was like, he was like, um, yeah, because we always just used to talk about it in the evening, eh? So we're just like, <laughs> let's call it Evening Records. It's kind of good. <laughs> that is the first song off Sub Rosa, put out by Evening Records. It's Great called bands. All the Alley Flowers. Beautiful song. What's the, what's the next one coming up? This is called Alley Fla All the Alley Flowers. It sounds in tune. Thank you. 
everyone I'm waiting till you get begun My eyes are down, I'm waiting for my cue It's all I want to do Timing. Good time for a <laughs> Hawks beverage. <laughs> Delicious. You couldn't have put it better. Smoky. I am going to have another one as well. Emerging out of the smoke. <laughs> um, Advertising. I wrote this EP um, like I'd write the song and then record it. So I'm still actually learning the lyrics because I haven't had a chance to sing them live. So I've got these cue sheets. But just then I found my mouth was so full. But I'll get better at it. What's, what's been so there? Very fresh songs. It's a, I mean, has the inspiration mainly been the lockdown, or is it, is it coming no, from elsewhere? No, I did it all before. You did lockdown. it all before. Yeah, I was just having a usual difficult time. And <laughs> you don't, you don't have to go into detail. <laughs> yeah. That's fine. I don't no, need, no, no, I no. Need no. <laughs> <laughs> um, such a folk singer. Um, <laughs> but uh, yeah, this one, I'll do a happier one. The shaker for this. I'm gonna try this out. But yeah, apologies again. If I'm gonna try and get these lyrics right, but there's a lot of them. This is called Lover Lover, you're just too much fun. Cool. I'll try and get this in here. Hear that? I can hear it, yeah. Good. Hang in paintings with such passion you make order in your life. I gotta check the key. That was close. Hang in paintings with such passion You make order in your life Yeah, but you introduce a chaos By holding parties through the night Your friends are all determined By the trueness of your laugh Well, I walked in on two of you And them all dizzy in the bath Yeah, I try to get some quiet rest When I'm feeling undone but I go crawling back again Cause lover, lover, you're just too much fun Yeah, well, your animals are patient As you pour your Spanish wine Your denim sways, your flowers grow You're laughing all the time you exchange lines with the best of them You hold it in your stride Yeah, your boyfriends come to see your room From every county line 
I try to get some quiet rest when I'm feeling undone. But I go walking down your street, cause lover, lover, you're just too much fun. I do not like to leave Yeah, I'm playing with my own mind And I'm treading on my feet You corner every player Yeah, you hold the Muppet mask Yeah, you lie about your future You tell the truth about your past I can't break any words tonight I'm broken and I'm spun But you'll just sideswipe anything Cause lover, lover you're just too much fun Yeah, I'm in the lane behind your house My battle's never won I climb the fence and drink a few Cause lover, lover, you're just too much fun Thank you I love that, man yeah, it's a, it's a jam. Oh, that's great. Thanks for having me. And, that's um, a pleasure. Yeah, I got right. a, I got a bit of a, I don't know, I, I got a bit of a Towns vibe with that. Towns Vans. Yeah, the old Towns I'm Vans. A fan. Yeah. I, can't, I won't say I'm not a fan. Yeah, I don't know where. Yeah, it's different, different rhythm, but like lyrically, yeah. big, big Towns. Tell the story. Yeah, awesome. It. Loved it. Loved um, it. Thanks for having me. And, I uh, love you. I love your shirt too, by the way. This is. This is from a band that I, uh, I've been a fan of for about uh, two hours now. <laughs> but I think they're my new favourite band. Yeah. Everyone stick around for Fables. They're coming up next. It's going to be sick. It's the first music I've seen in a long time. And they're going <laughs> to so be it's, freaking... it's really worth seeing. Yeah, I was just sitting there before and they amped up and I was like, oh, yes, man, it's been ages since I've seen a band. Like, so there's just two of them, but there's, there's plenty of sound there. Um, <laughs> it's going to be <laughs> good. Big. Guy's gonna be big. Um, oh, I better tune up. So, um, uh, so when when can we expect the new, uh, the new, the the next EP? Sub Rosa Part Two. I've got about two songs done. Two songs done. Yeah. So what's that? Another three to go, or yeah, probably about three or four. Three or four. Go. Okay, it's a big I'll EP. Try and, I'll try and push it. Yeah, cool, man. And then an album. And how are you recording it? You're just recording it at home, or doing it at home? Yeah, cool. Got a home, kind of a home studio setup. Just cool. I got some percussion instruments and. A Rhodes piano and a piano and a guitar. Got a Rhodes. Oh. I got a Rhodes. Wow. That's sick. Awesome. That's <laughs> yeah. enough. Yeah, that's <laughs> <sick. laughs> Awesome, um, man. Oh, I'm excited to hear it. And uh, yeah, just before I start rambling again, um, everybody just remember to go to the Surrey Hills Live GoFundMe. Is it GoFundMe? The GoFundMe. It's a GoFundMe? Yeah. yeah go, go look them up on GoFundMe and put the price of a beer in. They're doing a great thing. Um, Dean and Rob have been working their asses off for ages trying to get this going and I think everyone's thankful I've been tuning in so please everyone watching just go there and just put five, six, ten, twenty, fifty, whatever dollars in, whatever you can afford because it's a really good thing that's happening it's really positive so thanks for having me. And oh thank you Jay. Thank um, this song's you, called Love Is Not Enough. That you wanted has blown out the flame And you try to act cool But they just call your bluff Just remember Love is not enough Ew. When your servitude's spent And your friends turn away And you're talking out things That you don't want to say and you try to act kind, but somehow you were rough. Just remember, love is not enough. Hey, okay, okay. 
okay, you're gonna be fine You can do without this for a while You can do without this for a while Get yourself a drink and try to smile You're gonna do better in time Yeah, you're gonna feel better in time you're alone at night and you're shaking in sweat and your mind is alive and so full of regret then you're out in the ring but you just can't act tough just remember love is not enough hey okay okay you're doing fine you can live without love for you can live without love for a while Yeah, love is not the justice to the crime Yeah, it's gonna feel better in time You're gonna do better When your heart is a bird in a cage in a vault And your love's out of town and it's probably your fault And you're locked into sadness and you can't break the cup Just remember, love is not enough Cheers! How many songs have we got to go, Rob? Well, I've actually been counting, mate. Neither. <laughs> to Neither. be honest, I don't know I've, I've, I've just been enjoying it. I don't know. <laughs> it's uh, I don't know. You got like another couple? What do you Sweet. reckon? Have you got a couple good. in you? I've got lots in me. Okay. So you got. It's more you telling me. Have to we got? Stop. Have we? Have we got any comments coming up on the on the on the stream? I what's what's the? Uh, is there is there is there any coming up? Uh, we got one. Oh, that's my mum and dad. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Soon as I look up. Extra loud applause from Salisbury. That's the property they're on. Oh, well, hello, Salisbury. Salisbury. Salisbury, well, the original Salisbury's out uh, near uh, Broken Hill, like further, like Tipperborough. But that's um, where my mum grew up. But she's called her little property, or her and dad's little property near Katingal, near Tamworth, Salisbury. Still um, a fair way out. Oh, I feel it. I yeah. can't wait to go down there next. Just get out of Sydney, Sydney for a bit. Yeah, 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 totally. Write some country music. <laughs> Righto, well I'll do this one. This is um, let's 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 go let's go two I reckon. Yeah. Go two two. Go two. Let's go two. Righto. Yeah. Well, um, this one's the last song off Sub Rosa. Um, it's called Something Bigger Than Us. It's a little bit uh, depressing and long, so I apologise in advance. <laughs> teach you that love is the answer its pillar stands tall off the page but it's hard to find something that's gentle and kind if you keep on insisting on bleeding this way you're a separatist child you're a circus you're a casualty to the war you pretend I'm naive Cause you like to believe that nobody's been bruised quite like you before and i see how much of you is bruised and i know you're defensive and shot i've been picking at daisies for months now and i'm always stranded on forget-me-nots now i don't look too good now I'm clever, but I didn't look too good in love. Yeah, but neither of us are good looking. Just looking so hard is something bigger than us. Well, I know I 
I'm a piece of work, man. Should have seen the last one go. She was twisted and bent, her parade had been spent. All the floats were all crashed in a row. But she speaks to me kind and productive. Yeah, now we're seeing each other as square. With her Mexican fade in some big masquerade and her knotted out beauty and crystalline hair. Yeah, you don't know how much I would have had you or my servitude steady in gold. But the fires have painted the summer and I can't keep a grip and your feet are too cold. And the great void is standing in front of you. Baby, don't wait for me, just get on the bus. I'll be on one right there behind you. You might just arrive somewhere bigger than us. your shoe like some old bubble gum so elicit your pain take to it now let your vanity wear you away you're untouchable now yeah you're up in the clouds but the gods always fall it just follows that way and I'll be standing there right near the landing when you crash in the sand and the dust Yeah, I'll be looking at a parcel of beauty In a cabin of air holding something bigger than us Well, I'm sorry that I gave you my feather Yeah, it was too heavy for me And I just had to part your hands look so full as you mimic the cold But you'll be dancing a stage So much bigger than us Cheers. That's a big, beautiful song, man. It's a that's a big old song. That's a big, beautiful song. Gosh, wow. That's a big, fat one. Big, big one. Big Just went, blah. Here's a big, beautiful song. Yeah, every time I sing it, I kind of have to get over it. I have to like roll it down. After. Yeah, any it's Leonard insane. Cohen fans out there, I mean, like, yeah, fully. This is, oh, yes. No, Amazing. That's, that song is one of my main inspirations. There's no hiding. Well, wow, gosh, that was a beautiful song, man. Well done. Well done. All right, well, I'll do one more then, I guess. Well, I hope, I hope you're enjoying it out there in, 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 in the virtual virtual world because um, we're enjoying it here, and uh, we really are. Everyone, Cody's here, Ben's here, Fisk is here, Dean, Dean, Dean of the desk is behind the desk. How are you enjoying it, Dean? Are you having a good time? You know what, Rob, I'm loving it, and um, it reminds... Oh, it's not... Yeah, I am on. Uh, I'm loving it because I was saying to, to Jay earlier, I think the last gig that we shot... Was Jay? Was Jay. Yeah. Shakespeare Hotel. You and I were having a chat to camera. I brought it out the front. We had these beautiful shots of you in the front bar of the Shakespeare Hotel with the, the tram going past. That's the right, yeah. Around. It's lovely. So it's a nice full circle. Um, you know, you come come back onto camera with us and uh, it's amazing. Well, full circle, I think, will we'll be when, when we return. Mm. Yeah, I should have we said This is 180. 180. <laughs> 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 This is we're not we're not quite we're not quite flipped over yet. We're we're, we're upside down, but yeah. we'll get back there. We're all over the place. We're all, yeah, <laughs> but we will get back. And uh, and look, to be honest, I can't wait. But uh, 
but it's sounding amazing man like Thank it's you. it's really sounding beautiful and the songs the songs are exp just just fantastic and you you know you've obviously been sitting and really working on them and they're they're, they're, they're bloody great songs Thank you. Yeah, and um I'll let's just reiterate where, where people can get them because um there's going to be people out there where um just on bandcamp now um it'll be on streaming services later, but you can go over to Bandcamp, uh, look up Jay Squire at Bandcamp, or just go to my Instagram or Facebook. I think you guys will share the links. Have we? For okay. Anybody. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I emailed them to Dean before, I think. But um, okay. yeah, uh, and yeah, go on. You can get them for free if you don't have any cash, which is fine. But give or him money. Can, or you can pay me. Yeah, give him some money fine. for <laughs> all the work he's put into these beautiful songs. He deserves some, um, some reward. Yeah. So they're all on Bandcamp and they'll be out on the more popular streaming services in a couple of months, probably. Cool, man. Yeah. Great. So what's, what's our last song that we're going to hear? Our last song's off my first EP, which is also available on Bandcamp. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's called uh, Don't Want to Lose You Over This. Great. Um, um, yeah, that's, that's it. So thanks for having me. And I'm far away Yeah, the plot has come to some quintessential twist Or maybe I just needed some time here to unwind Or maybe love can move like the mountains over time Or maybe you just need a more consistent manly kind To lend your kiss But I don't want to lose
what fun. <laughs> yes, Jay, I wish you could keep going, man. Oh, so sweet, but we've got fables up now. We have fables up. Fables. We have fables. 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 We get a shot on that shirt. Look, look at how handsome he is in that bloody shirt. Fables. Look at that. <laughs> Together at last, the two of them just Hawks Brewery riding horses. We should get Daryl in here. Um, look, uh, that was beautiful. I hope you enjoyed that at home because that was just stellar in here. And that's my job really to do the sound. So you did enjoy it at home, but I, I, I loved it. Um, we have fables coming up and they're just going to blow the roof off this place. And I'm so excited to have them here. Um, but before before fables come up, we have um, Urban Village, our local, our local rag, our local newspaper um, have come in and they've interviewed um, Jen who, who's doing some amazing things um, in, this, in this COVID time, um, looking, after, looking after our most vulnerable uh, our, our homeless people. And it's a, it's a great interview um, and stick around, stick around for that. It's gonna come up right now. After that, we've got an interview with Cody Dillon about his quarantunes. tunes. He's got some folk in there, he's got some disco in there, and he's got all sorts of stuff in there. And then after that, we've got the epic set from Fables. Fables are coming up, so uh, stick around. We'll see you in a few minutes. Don't forget Kathy Lou, Rob. Oh, Kathy Lou. Oh my gosh. How can I forget Kathy? song, Dedication Oh my segment. gosh, I'm Kathy, so I'm sorry. Excited. I love you. I didn't, yeah. mean, I didn't mean to forget you. you it's know. all right. It's I all right. We don't have a run uh, sheet. Let's, let's go to Urban Village, though, <laughs> now that you've mentioned them. Uh, Urban Village are going to be coming on and doing like a bit of a segment, what's happening in the neighbourhood. Uh, this is the first time they're, for, they're doing it. I want to welcome Tess. Tess, are you there? How are you, Tess? I'm good, thanks, Dean. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. Uh, so this week, we are going to be chatting to Jen Webster, uh, who is the Fundraising and Community Engagement Manager for Rough Edges. Right. And for those who don't know, uh, Rough Edges is a community cafe and uh, kind of drop-in centre. They have lots of different services for our homelessness and marginalised communities around the inner city, and they're on Victoria yeah, Street in Darlinghurst. Um, so I've got Jen on the line here. Jen, how are you? Good, thanks, Tess. Um, so just quickly, um, tell us about uh, Rough Edges and what you guys do. So Rough Edges is this, if you've ever walked past it or volunteered there or been in the area, it's this wonderful space where communities come in, drop in, as you said, and um, ideally connections are made. So it's this, we serve homeless and marginalised, vulnerable communities in the area and, um, you know, somewhere where we want to be a safe space that people can gather and, um, you know, have a game of Scrabble, read a book, enjoy a meal, connect with one another. Um, yeah. And then under, underpinning that, we offer counselling services, um, legal services and support for women experiencing domestic or family violence. Yep, yep, amazing. And... Um, what have been the biggest challenges for Rough Edges during the pandemic? For us, it's been how to provide continuity. So acknowledging the health and safety of our patrons has been foremost. So ensuring mm. that they remain safe while we continue to nourish their um, stomachs and their souls. Yep, yep. And um, yeah, Sorry, you I go. think just making sure that we are there for them through this and that they are feeling supported and not just left um, um, to their own devices. So we've obviously, like everyone, had to adapt our services. We've moved to a takeaway model instead of it being a drop-in and, and share a meal. Um, yeah. Yeah, and what we're finding, interestingly, is that people are missing the connection yeah. more so than the actual food. Yeah, well, I was going to ask you, I mean, what's what's... What are some of the stories that you've kind of seen from, you know, um, the people that you work with about how they've been affected and then what, what um, the response has been from the way you said, you know, you've pivoted to take away, like, but um, that's not necessarily giving them the social interaction that they might mm. be um, needing during this time. I mean, kind of what's been sort of the feedback? So the feedback has been, so some of perhaps our prickliest customers um, mm. have actually called and said they've missed us. Yeah. You know, I, what I observed yesterday, I was in at the, um, so yesterday we opened during the daytime and then four nights a week. 
we have people that come just to connect with or catch up with one another. They don't aren't necessarily coming for food or for care packs. They're just coming to have some human interaction. Um, and what is being done to ensure that uh, COVID-19 doesn't start the next wave of homelessness in the city? Yeah, this is something we're thinking about all the time and reports I'm getting from other services is that we're all generally seeing about a 20% increase on new faces mm. coming for support. Yeah. Um, so we and, and other services are putting a few initiatives into place. So we're working with Canis's Kitchen and Elizabeth Bay to develop a, um, a Let's Connect service so that we can do a, um, a weekly check-in and it's a volunteer run service so people do a weekly phone call check-in. What that enables us to do is just to understand what's going on for people. Do they, you know, are there food security issues? Is it housing? Um, do they need legal or is it social isolation? Yeah. And what um, have you found is the most pressing um, issue? Look, the, the, the food security is a real problem. So yeah. kind of as an adjunct to the, the let's connect, mm. what we're doing is offering care packs to anyone that needs them. Yeah. So that people don't have to work out, can I eat or pay the rent? Yeah, yeah, um, yeah, that's fantastic. And I think, you know, it's a few services, you know, it's, just, it's another financial stress point. If you've already typed the money and then you have to think about buying food, um, you know, we, we want to eliminate that. Mm. A lovely um, initiative that's come up in conjunction with the Darlow Darlings Group is they've established a Darlow pantry yep. in Victoria Street just down the road from us. Yep. And that works on the basis of donate what you can and take what you need. So if anyone is doing it tough, there's food there. The challenge we have is the food's going as quickly as we can put it out. Mm, so yeah. there's a real need for that. And um, they're looking at how they can make that a, a permanent fixture. Yep, definitely. It's such a good initiative. Yeah. Um, and I guess by that same vein, uh, what are some tangible ways that people watching can uh, help out with your initiatives? The, the, the bottom line we say to people is donate what you can. Mm. If you're in a position to give money, that would be amazing. Yep. Um, if you could hold a fundraiser, if you can give through your workplace giving, if you have that opportunity, if you work for a company that might be in a position to support um, any of the services, if you live locally and can donate to the Dallow Pantry, yep. that would be fabulous. Or if you've got other ideas, just reach out yep. to me through the um, the Facebook page. Yeah, totally. And um, just quickly, uh, I just wanted to get your thoughts um, on last month, the New South Wales government announced that um, rough sleepers will actually be able to self-isolate for 30 days in a three to five star hotel um, around the city. Uh, so I was wondering what you thought about the um, success of that and so, if they can only self-isolate for 30 days, what kind of happens after those 30 days? Yeah, that's the biggest question I think everyone's got. Mm. You know, we if you saw the um, project feature on this, some people it's inspired them to want to change their lifestyle mm. and get out of rough sleeping. Um, I'd say for a lot of people, you know, we'll see the 30 days end up and they'll be back to rough sleeping because they simply don't have any other options and there's not enough affordable housing or social housing. Yeah. Yeah. So that's, you know, it comes back to this cycle of, you know, we've got to get more social housing for people that need that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you um, so much, Jen. That's all we've got time for. Um, so if you are interested in donating or helping out, um, head to the Rough Edges website or the Facebook page. Um, and yeah, Jen, thank you so much for your time today. You're right. Thank you, Tess. Thanks, Jen. Bye. Bye.
Um, All right, sorry, we, we interrupt this broadcast. There's oh. been a, a, terrible, a terrible thing has happened. Oh. Uh, it's not a, not a bad news story, don't worry. It's just that we didn't have any sound. For oh, the, I thought that might have happened. Bit, uh, some sort of a glitch in the system, a gremlin in the system. So uh, I apologize, and I, I want to thank Jason Watt for putting a big comment up on Facebook oh, thanks, going, Jason. what's with the sound? Thanks, Jason. Uh, so, and I apologize. I think we've, we've been doing this for seven weeks. We've never had like a, oh my God, there's no sound moment, even though we're, uh, pu we're pulling all this together. So listen, I apologize to the people of Surrey Hills, and I want to backtrack a little bit, <laughs> yeah? All right, so for those who've just joined us with sound, <laughs> Surrey Hills Live for the seventh time in a row. Um, this man in front of me is uh, Cody Dillon. Here we go, hello, once hello. again. Uh, <laughs> and, and long story short, uh, Cody played uh, last week on Surrey Hills Live and has played many times before that. Uh, at the Shakespeare Hotel, he is a local man about town. He also throws very good parties, <laughs> particularly the one on Mardi Gras. I was at the party before I even knew Cody. That's, That's how good the party was. It was world. an amazing block party. Anyway, um, apologies again. But listen, tell us, because as well as playing on Surrey Hills Live, like last week, which was incredible, um, yeah. and playing around town, what, you're doing stuff. What's happening? You're in quarantine. What's, what's going on? I've started a little isolation radio station. Uh, it's called Quarantunes. You can find it on SoundCloud. And I just have so much music I'm trying to share. Not just dancey stuff, although it's going to get a bit dancey now, because that's fun for me. But uh, it started with a country one, Quarantunes one. It's country, folky style songs. I had a soul one second. I take as much pride in the artwork. That had Kevin Costner slow dancing Whitney Houston. It's lots of soul love songs. Three was twerking from home. If you are working from home or you want to work out um, or work it, it's that, that's the mix for you. It's, it's, it's got a lot of songs with the word work in them, as many songs about working and unemployment as I could find. You'll find all, all genres in that one. And then the last one I'm most happy about was the disco one. That's really your, that's your more bang for your buck if you want to boogie and dance. I love that one. Um, yeah, so I'm having heaps of fun with it, mm -hmm. and every week I try to do one whenever I get That's around to it. That's freaking amazing. I man. work and hard on them. You, yeah. are, you are qualified to do this. <laughs> You're not just some amateur, amateur like, because you would DJ, like you would play at the Shakespeare Hotel on Devonshire. This and is you, true. And you'd go all the way down the street, and, and an hour later you'd be on the decks DJing at the Strawberry Hills back in the day. Until 5.30 in, in the morning on a Thursday night. Um, I loved it, yeah. Uh, various house parties, warehouses. Anyway, anywhere anyone invites me, I did a workout class once. What do you call it? Like an aerobics class? Like an aerobics class? Yeah, like that was Fonda awesome. Time. That That's was amazing. amazing. Uh, yeah, I love DJing. Um, but it's nice to do it like at home in my studio, actually really not like planning the mixes and curating them a bit so they have a bit of a flow or a story. I usually just play tunes and make a decision based at a party. What, what's that song? What's the next one? Just, just based on the song I'm currently playing. So it's nice to like map them out. And yeah, I hope people enjoy. Um, they're on there. You, you have a link, I think, in, in your page. Or you can just Google Cody Dillon on um, you can just, just, uh, SoundCloud. Follow the link that I just put up on, on the screen. So Thank you. So there um, are certain technical the capabilities. Yeah, but the last uh, one I'm very happy yeah. with. No, it's, it's amazing. What did you say, Rob? I'll, I'll turn your mic up. I'll cut to you. <coughs> oh, you wait. Said, sorry, you said, I wasn't sure. It's the last one. Oh, I mean, I've checked all of them out. The last one, I was, I was dancing in, in the kitchen while I was cooking. And uh, it's the disco theme. And it's a fantastic thing. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's like underground disco, like Paradise Garage, like Larry Levan, not exactly Saturday Night Fever, but um, some of the songs you might recognise, but um, some good obscure gems, just music I love. It's, it's, it's great. Um, how, long, how long is it? It's about an hour and a half? It's about an hour, I think. An hour? I don't really look at the time much when I'm doing it, but um, yeah, they're all about an hour, which is a nice amount. Um, but they're just going to keep rolling out, and uh, yeah. I well, we we, we, we look forward to uh, to having 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 them on here at uh, at Surrey Hills Live. We should. And, we um, should. And can we can we can we play them towards the end of the set? Can we can we can we link to it? Is that no, is that Rob, possible? You, you've got to give me. A, you've got to tell me in advance what's on uh, the show. You've got to tell me. <laughs> this is, you can't just throw it on me. <laughs> Wait. You know. Can we? You've got to can tell we, me in advance. Can we? Yeah. Can no. We, can, no, we can't. Can we? Can we? Can we put them on and have us all <laughs> dance? Under these beautiful lights with the cameras, is that is that? Well, it's it, I don't know. Is there any copyright music? Because we're on Facebook. We're, it's we're all copyright music. Well, then no, it's, we no, can't. We can't. We're okay. streaming ah, damn. Jeez, we've been through this before. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the yeah. Facebook thing. Every, I anyway. mean, I, you know, you know what is funny? I did ask you this before we went to camera, <laughs> and it's uh, <laughs> no way. Anyway, listen, we got, we we've got a lot a lot on this. this we tonight. do, we've we got do. Fables. It's going to be amazing. But Cody, I wanted to ask you. Yeah. You've obviously, you're obviously a man who takes full advantage of quarantine and and hats off to you brother what's uh, uh, you know aside from this incredible project what's your favorite thing about the lockdown 
Uh, not working. Uh, mm. Yeah, I'd, I'd definitely say <laughs> just doing music all day long and not, not doing my day job, which was teaching. I'm kind of like Batman, I have a night job and a day job. So just doing the night job all the time is probably my favourite thing. Um, just making music, yeah, so waking that, up in so the morning. So you're Batman now? I'm, I'm Batman. You're Batman? Now. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> or Bruce Wayne, I don't know. Um, yeah, so, uh, just, just all the time um, to, to, to do focus solely on music and make these mixes that I've always wanted to do and never even knew where the record button was because I only played live. So it's, it's yeah, I'd say Quarantunes is my favourite thing. <laughs> Amazing, man. You're an inspiration. You are a local mm. inspiration um, and we thank you. <laughs> thank uh, you. We thank you for your beautiful work live because uh, it's a contrast. I mean, you know, you, you do beautiful folk music and mm. sort of folk country stuff. And then you, you're hitting the decks, and I mean, is the, uh, tell us about the contrast, you know. Oh, yeah, well, I love all varieties of music. Obviously, the folky country storytelling thing is something I do, but I also like deep Berlin Bergheim techno. Beautiful. Um, the darker the better, so there'll be a range of um, styles on these mixes, and I just it's just me um, showcasing all the music I love. I love it all, so many different kinds, so I've got some funny zany ideas of future mixes. So good, man. Well, um, we, yeah, we thank, you, thank you, thank you for sharing it, and thanks for having me also as a live performer. Uh, a lot of people out there don't know, but it really makes a big difference for us just to pay the rent. Um, so this has been so helpful. We really appreciate all the sponsors and you guys for doing it for us. Um, it's really amazing. Thank you and thanks for everyone for donating and being involved. It's great. Well, thank you, Cody. Thank you, Cody. Well, look, if yeah. you if you do if you are uh, you know watching this and you you are so inclined to keep this stream going, we are literally the entire funding for this whole stream is coming from the GoFundMe. People have been. Uh, nice and generous. Uh, this allows us to pay artists. It allows us to pay the people who work on the show and obviously the facilities that, that go into it. We would be very grateful for a contribution which might just be the price of a beer. Um, and uh, we're hoping that we can struggle on uh, through this uh, COVID-19 thing to bring you more live streams over the following weeks. Um, Right now, however, we have got something really exciting, which is, this is kind of, I think this is my favorite thing about, about lockdown, about quarantine, is Kathy Lou's uh, love song dedications, because they are full on, um, just sad and funny <laughs> and tragic. And we thank you, Kathy Lou, for doing these. Uh, it's amazing. Uh, we're going we're gonna, to uh, jump right over to Kathy right now, and when we come back, uh, we're going to be s launching right into the heartland of Mm. Thank you guys, Dean, Rob. Um, I'm glad to see you both alive and glad to be back. So welcome back to uh, Love in the Time of COVID-19 Love Song Dedications. So today we are going to continue to count down the top 100 coronavirus songs. At 68, we have Bridge Over Troubled Water by Simon and Garfunkel, dedicated to Netflix. At 67, In the Club, 50 Cent, Zoom Parties. 66, I Can't Get No Satisfaction by the Rolling Stones. Online Video Dates. 65, Hello by Adele, FaceTime again. And at 64, The Longest Time, Billy Joel. This Virus. Anyway, guys, stay alive, stay alive, stay alive. <laughs> wow. Okay, that, we're coming I in. We're coming in now. Is that miserable or is that? I mean, it's very funny, but it also makes me sad. Rob, how are we doing over there? How are we doing? Are we ready with uh, our fables doing? This is the. Uh, this is the first. I'm going to take my headphones off. This is the first. Uh, First sound job I'm going to do at Summer Hills Live, I'm going to stand up because I, I just feel like I have to stand up for this set because it's so big. If I was sitting down, I'd be like, I'd feel weird. <laughs> so it's, it's just like these, these we, we, we carried, I don't know if the cameras can, can the cameras capture the amount of sound equipment we brought down for two people here? It's just an epic, big, beautiful, lush sound. And uh, I'm so happy to have Fables here. Yeah. Fables, can we give it up? Yeah. Fables. All right. All right. <laughs> Fables are Ben and Hisk. Hiska. This is going to be amazing. Thank you. Thanks for coming down. You're too kind. You haven't heard us yet. <laughs> well, yeah. Could be a disaster. Well, that's not. Well, I don't think it's going to be. Well, usually it is. But I'm, no, I'm, 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 I'm pretty excited about this. What's the first song we're going to hear? 
Piccolo. Piccolo. Let's do it.
find a God that I know all and star me. Thank you.
Bye, Fifi. Cheers, thank you. <laughs> I hope we're not depressing anyone too much out there. <laughs> guys having us here thank you very much we're loving it very much lots of atmosphere and corks beer oh, look ben you're in pink and i'm in blue it's very lovely that? <laughs> that's all right What have we got coming up? Hey, hey, do you guys have, do you guys possibly, can I, can I use yes. this moment? Chris, can you get a shot on me? Oh, into the light, I'm finding the light. Look at these, look at these beautiful, wait, I got, no, because it's opposite. Look at these beautiful album covers. Look at these gorgeous things. Fables, <laughs> they, have, they have good t-shirts. <laughs> You've got to find the light. You've got to find the light, Jay. Find the light. It's over there. Fables. Buy a t-shirt. Fables, buy a t-shirt. Wait, are we, are we doing a package but deal? We have a oh, is, is that what price. we're doing? For the best comment. If, if the best comment in the Fables set, I think we've decided. Wait, I'm looking at that camera. Thank you, Chris. Chris is our director of photography here. Um, thank you, Chris. Uh, the best comment in the Fables set gets this CD and this CD and the shirt that Jay is wearing. Is it the shirt no, that you're no, wearing? No, we're going to no. make a new one because he should keep it now. He played the whole okay. set in that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's totally new. <laughs> Not the shirt that Jay's wearing because he played How the whole set in that. We'll do a new one for you. <laughs> yes. But, but the best, com best, comment, best comment over the next um, 30 minutes gets two CDs, uh, uh, of the beautiful Fables music and, and a t-shirt made um, by Hisco herself. She makes the t-shirts um, handmade, right? They're, they're handmade t-shirts? Yes. Yeah. Amazing. Right. Well, best comment. Handmade. Go, yeah. <laughs> handmade. Go forth. Thank you, Maria, <laughs> for making the stencil of my painting. Uh, I'm loving this. I'm loving this set. What, 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 what's, what's coming up? This is a new uh, track. A new yes! A new track. We've just named we it. Never played it before, we just anyone. called it open. So, okay. Except before we had a sound check and we played it. Yeah. So we don't know how it can go, but no we're just going to do it because with new songs, what do you do? You have to you just have to play them, now. don't you? Yeah, you've got to play them. What's it called? And if no one likes it, you just. Well, oh, it's called Open. 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 Oh, open. I love this song. Open. This song is amazing. We've never played it before. It's the first time we've ever played it. So. Oh, it's a beautiful there song. There you go. It's a gorgeous song. Funny the word open. Yeah, it's a bit... We'd like things to open, wouldn't we? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I'm enjoying not everything being like the 1970s in Sydney. It reminds me when I grew up in Sydney when there wasn't much traffic around and it was all very relaxed. Very chill. Yes. Without the death. Oh, that's yeah, the, death is bad. Strange thing yeah. about it. So, yeah, in some ways it's interesting, this whole environment we're in, but well, yeah. don't last forever. No, we don't. <laughs> Are you, wait, can we get a shot, just quickly, of, um, of Hiska's foot, how she Velcroed the egg to her foot? Because that's, that's interesting. I mean, as, as, in, in as much as all their gear is interesting, just, just the... She has Velcroed... That's very innovative. Very clever. Thank you. Thank you, Chris. Thank you. All right. Let's hear it. Not Open. Be serious again, because we're so serious, you know. We are very serious man. Let's just go. Extremely serious. Yeah, you can't laugh at home. No, you, know, you can't have fun. No fun you're at too home serious tonight. For that. All right. Bad luck. I thought I had to play the song now. I can't remember. <laughs>
It was epic. That was all right. Went all right. Thought that went all right. <laughs> yeah, you know, first go. You know, you know, bit of a few fluffs, but that's it. <laughs> <laughs> that, was a, that was amazing. Man. That's so outrageous. That was amazing. <laughs> well, that's it. <laughs> oh gosh, we're out. I'm going we're, to. We're 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 we're, we're going. I'm going to go home and sit at home. You have a sip of this of a beer, Ben. This is lovely beer. Hawks. I've got lager here. Lager. I, lo I love that you've still got the, the lager, 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 lager. And also... Lager! Lager! lager. <laughs> but Surrey Hills Live, we have to think about that. There's a GoFundMe page on Surrey Hills Live. We've had enough of the Hawks stuff. We've got to go to this, this, please. On Surrey Hills Live, if you want to donate anything to the good cause, which is the wonderful thing it is, you can go onto the page and there's a GoFundMe Go section or you can click on it or whatever. If you want to keep this going, please. Yep. Five dollars, ten dollars, whatever, for a beer or something. Do it. It's a great thing. And we need it at the moment, definitely, don't we? So yeah. Thanks, Ben. Cheers, mate. Okay. Sounding awesome, guys. What um next track is what's coming up? Next track is from our second album we did in two thousand and sixteen. That one called High. Can I get a? Oh, sorry. And um, yeah, it's a kind of bit more up. This one track. It's a beautiful it's cover. This one. did the painting. It's really nice. Beautiful cover. Did you do that, Hisko? Yeah, it's a painting. Um, Rory bought it. He's got a, some a friend of <laughs> some one in Newtown has that painting. Same as the first album. Um, that painting was sold to someone in Newtown or. It's great to yeah. do the paintings and the music and ooh, it's a gorgeous album and it mind. sounds amazing too. It's so yeah. it's, it's such a such a well well produced oh, piece. Yeah, Gear Grillian from Studio On South. He's uh, a sound engineer and he's producing our next album. Oh fantastic. Tomorrow we're mixing again. We oh are great. Getting close to the album number three. And when can we expect that coming out? Well, Later in the year. Yeah, later in this year we hope, and we hope to do it with a live gig, but it might be digital online, we'll see. Because we keep Come writing back here new stuff, to, yeah. and it's like so hard to do. Okay, we want that on the album too, but we have already decided what we want on the album. Well, I'm excited. Yeah. I'm very excited. Uh, Guy is a fantastic producer we work with. He's from, originally from Reykjavik, okay. from Iceland. He's yep. amazing. He's got that kind of interesting Icelandic spin on things. If there ever was a thing, I think it kind of was a thing a while ago. And New Zealand had it as well on, in the 80s. Like a unique kind of style that, because they were isolated communities on yeah. islands and stuff, it kind of created a kind of magical kind of, you know, original kind of sound and stuff. So yeah, I... I Gears kind of got that, you know. Great. Yeah, yeah. great. Yeah. New perspective. Yeah. Yeah, Isolation. Great. <laughs> <laughs> it's basically that. The word of the day, and yes. We don't really mind it because it's, uh, it feeds right. our creativity. What are we, what's coming up? It's we just we talked about it. it. Yeah, yeah. Let's, let's hear it. It's called Against It. Yep. Fantastic. Yeah. 
got one more to go. <laughs> Is that all right? Is that more t enough time? Yeah. This is the mines. It's probably like midnight. <laughs> said uh, Fable's awesome as always. <laughs> I'll pay my friend later. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, well, maybe. Well, well that's, it's up to you who, who's the best comment. Might be biased a little bit, but that's okay. What, so we've got one song left, right? Yep. We've got one song left for Fable's. Well, it's up to you. <laughs> the greatest song in the world ever made. Tenacious D. Exactly. Please don't play that song. <laughs> or it could be the worst song you've ever made. <laughs> yeah. You can play this one more time. It could be Stairway to Heaven. There's a yellow one. I love that song. There's it's a good. Beer. It's good. I think his go. With, your, with, with, with the with the delay going with that with that is just no no I love it I love it the beer 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 beer, 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 beer. it's like you're calling it down from a mountain to people it's like beer 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 beautiful it's beautiful all right we better play a song before we I won't open it disgrace ourselves anymore you guys can get on with your normal daily activities no you guys have been just beautiful Thank you so much having us. So great. Right. Let's do it.
Thanks a lot, you guys. Thank you. Amazing. Fables. Yes. Kick that bass. That's, that's how I do it. Uh, thank you so much for having us, guys. Awesome. You're the best. Well, thank you, Ben. Thank you really nice. Hiska. Cool. Rob, Jay, and you wonderful cameraman. It's, uh, <laughs> Sorry. I, think, I, think, I think that was just unbelievable. I hope you enjoyed it at home. Ben. Dan, Hiska, Fables. This is getting Woo! Sick. Oh, Fables! <laughs> yes! Some I've got two CDs here. Uh, I think there's a package deal going. There's a T-shirt which is going to be made by Hiska personally, f and uh, you get these two CDs for the best comment. What a what a what a package! What a deal! Uh, get, I feel like I'm I'm on like breakfast TV. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's like, and not only that, but you get you get nice. Jay Squire to sing your songs. No, you don't. We need He's to not going to do nice that. Uh, but uh, Chip but. In. <laughs> But wow, what a set by Fables. That was incredible. What a set by Jay Squire. Hey, wasn't that beautiful? That was, that was just a beautifully epic set. And, I, I, and I, I, I really loved all the sounds coming out of this basement tonight. Um, next week, we have some amazing musicians coming up. We have uh, Mr. Leroy Lee and Oliver Thorpe. And uh, they're coming in and they're going to do some great tunes for us as well so so stick around uh well not right now go and do whatever you're going to do but come back in a week don't stick around bugger off but come back in in seven days and uh and come and join us again for surrey hills live thanks to fables Thank thanks Rob. to jay squire thanks to dean what a night yeah it's incredible uh funny you mention uh morning tv uh, breakfast tv because uh tomorrow morning if you are someone who watches sunrises then they're going to be broadcasting live from the JJ Squire's basement from 5.30 in the morning. Sunrise. Right? Super early call time. Uh, we're doing a live drawing class here in the basement. Uh, it'll be on Sunrise on Channel 7. Amazing. Thank you, everyone. Uh, see you next week. If you want to see more live streaming, please chip in the cost of the beer at gofundme.com forward slash Surrey Hills Live. This has been an absolute pleasure. Good evening and good luck. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha!